Das ist nicht eine wilde Musik, das ist nicht eine extrem ähm, erfinderische Musik. Trotzdem ist es eine Musik mit sehr viel Disziplin und doch sehr viel Eleganz gleichzeitig. Insofern, ich bilde mir zumindest ein, dass ich königliche Klänge höre. I love the music of J.S. Bach because ever since I was a little kid, I was playing Bach's music. And nowadays, I hear Bach's music in all types of music. Rock music, jazz music, and all music emulates from Bach. Man, the flute. The flute is one of the world's most ancient instruments. It's been around since the dawn of man. I love playing the flute, first off, because it is so small. It fits in my luggage when I travel everywhere. But also there's something very cool about using your breath to play the flute. There's something very soulful about using that as part of the musical making of the instrument. Damn. Baroque music is really one of my favorite things to play. Um, I really love it because it gives a chance to have a lot of walking bass lines and moving bass lines. And it, it reminded me of uh, when I was a kid playing jazz music. And you know, jazz music is all about walking bass lines and the rhythm coming from the bass. And I just love it. And it's cool how that, you know, goes together. Baroque music and jazz music and hip hop music. It's playing the bass is the best thing. King Frederick the Great was not only a cool king, but he was a good composer. And his flute book has some pretty sweet jams in it. It's, how would I say it? It's like fluffy classical pop music. You could tell like maybe the king, he didn't have too much time. And so when it was time to play his flute, it was just the coolest stuff ever. I use the book all the time and I love to teach from it. It's the jam, fellas. <laughs> Ja, er hat für damalige Zeit eine große Qualität gehabt.